this was Aldi's. Um, I ended up having to do a stock up on some snacks and stuff between my husband and my child. So, and I found a few things. And so we'll start over here. I take cucumbers and tomatoes and just put them into Ziploc bags, like four of them. And it's just a snack for the week. And I cut these just into chunks and wash the tomatoes. And it's just a good snack for me to have at work while I'm there. Blueberries for the dragon, as always. The cherries were $1.99 a pound. So we went through and got the ones we wanted. Jalapenos, because I'm going to do the bacon wrapped jalapenos just as a side item for this week. I needed trash bags and this Belgian waffle maker was reduced down to $11. It's a Christmas gift for my son, youngest son's girlfriend. She loves breakfast and I give all the boys cash every year, a set amount, but I always give them extras in their bags. So this is one of her extras this year. Um, they had these in the Aldi find. It is for a two-tier spice rack. I have a spice rack, but it is the ones with, I don't know, they look like they belong in your closet and they've got the wire and things fall through. So I wanted something more substantial. I got some pasta just to have. Tanner wanted honey roasted peanuts. I never know how they go through as much steak sauce as they do but I got him to restock his shelf. I got him granola bars, Rice Krispie treats. Now I'm gonna share that with him. That is a 28 pack coffee for me. My husband wanted honey buns. He would never respond if he wanted Chex Mix or not. I went ahead and got it. My granola bars, his honey roasted cashews. Um, I got center cut bacon. Uh, cheese burgers for cheeseburgers, chicken. I don't know what I'll do with it, um, but it was $2.99 for chicken thighs. That's always a good price. I'm just going to throw them in the freezer. My husband asked for breakfast bowls this week. He has the pancakes by Jimmy Jean on a stick with the sausage to take in the morning. He also has breakfast burritos that I make. So I thought I'd try one from here. I picked up more at... Myers, but I thought we'd try one of the Aldi's mixed vegetables just for a quick night of something for a veggie. Cream cheese for the jalapeno bites. Sourdough for toast. I've never gotten these. I usually get the brioche from there. These are a lot cheaper, and you got eight of them, although I don't really need eight for the burgers tonight. Milk, water, almond milk for me and stock for the dog. This was Myers. This was 57, but that was after $18 worth of credits. I had 15 with my points and a $3 free produce item, so I used it. I've got dill and these are pickles. I'm gonna can some pickles. I got two more sweet potatoes. We're gonna do taco salads this week, so I picked up that. Um, my, these were buy one, I don't know, there were two for eight. Um, so I got him the honey barbecue and the spicy jalapeno. Yes, it was restock the, the snack cabinet. Um, bananas. I'm gonna try this in cottage cheese. Not sure I'm gonna like it, but I figure I'll try it. Dax needed some green beans, two more of the breakfast bowls for my husband for breakfast, just so he has some variety besides the burritos I make, two jars of his cheese sauce, spaghetti seasoning just for whatever I want to use it for. I needed some eyeliner. I needed Tylenol PM, and they've got a good deal on it and price. And then I looked up in the cabinet and I had another bottle for the pickles. Tanner for juice and my husband. And as I said, I saved $18, but this was still $57. So this got me. This was my over the budget. This is Kroger. 
and I spent seventy-seven oh three. But here's here's why. That's chuck roast, and it's on sale for four ninety nine a pound. So I ended up with three point two pounds for fifteen dollars. Butter was two ninety nine. Chicken was a dollar forty nine a pound. I probably should have gotten like five of them, and I might still go back. Um, I paid like seven dollars for this. I these were on sale, not great, but Tanner called and said he is going to be home for dinner, so I had four hamburgers. That wasn't enough. These are a dollar ninety nine. Normally, these are three ninety nine. I love these because they just make a really quick, easy side item. So I went ahead and picked two of them up. Yes, I always buy bacon, but it was $2.99 a package. There's no arguing with that. You throw them in the freezer. I needed pickle crisp for the pickles, and I picked these up. They were on sale. I could have probably gotten them either the same price or even cheaper at Walmart but I was there, so I went ahead and picked them up. And God knows, after being over budget this week, I really didn't want to go to Walmart. But the thing is, with my budget, our budget is 200 a week, is what I have in my head. We were at like 150, 160 before I walked in there. I couldn't pass up these meat deals. It was just, they were too good to pass up so this is why I have wiggle room. So the weeks that I don't spend my 200, I put it back in my savings account. So it's always there. So I always have it. So I'm able to pick stuff up. 